good afternoon. I think it's now the next day. I didn't film anything yesterday and I've been in work or at work all day today and yesterday so I didn't really vlog much and yeah I just am ready for now to be the weekend and not be working anymore but we've checked into our hotel. It's funny that I didn't show you our nice hotel and now I'm showing you this hotel but we checked out of our hotel that my work got for us and it's Hilton Hotel and very nice and fancy and now we are in here <laughs> but it does have like such a nice view and I don't know if you guys can see what I can see but there's a Trader Joe's right across the street um, but yeah we are so excited to be here and finally have some time together Sebastian just been like you know going to coffee shops doing his own thing while i've been working and then tomorrow is going to be like our big explore all around day because it's a little bit after five i think or just now five it's 4 45. oh okay so it's not five yet um so we still have the night but tomorrow will be all day which is so good and yeah so happy to be here we're gonna scare carly when she comes over here i'm gonna scare her I was looking for you. This is one of the hardest parts, the hills. Oh my god. We were just literally talking about how every time we go to San Francisco something crazy happens. The first time we went before we watched a dog get ran over on the street, which is not funny. It was fun, but it was insane. Now we're just walking and those fire trucks that you've just heard, there were like four, five, five fire trucks. At least five or six. At least five fire trucks because someone's oven was on fire. Show them, show them. Well, no. Well, now that I know everyone's okay, um, but there's just, you can't really see, but there's, ah. you took video. I'm going to insert a clip of it in my vlog down here. Well, I didn't want to seem go. insensitive, um, but everyone's fine. Everything, they got it done quickly. It was crazy. So every time we come to San Francisco, oh, something sucks, insane sucks. happens. tours if you're ever in San Francisco. We've done their bikes now twice and we love them. They're so nice. They're electric which we love and they're a good price for the whole day and breakfast was absolutely delicious and so let's let's see the rest of San Francisco. Yeah it is. <laughs> okay scratch Dylan's. <laughs> we went there yesterday and they said oh you don't need to make a reservation we'll have them and then we get there this morning and they don't have any so we have to look for another place interesting but Sebastian's on that maps game gonna find me an e-bike Taking a nice break from our bikes. <laughs> and <laughs> Mr. Stretchy. And I don't know. We'll just keep figuring out where we're gonna go. We've stopped all oh, this helicopter. <laughs> there we go. We stopped off at Trader Joe's and no, it's going back. <laughs> why? Oh my god, they found us. Oh my god. 
<laughs> Just stopped off for a little bit of a rest. Our butts are getting a little sore <laughs> and we're gonna eat um, our snacks. We got a little bit from Trader Joe's, so. We're just gonna eat and sit here. It's so pretty. <laughs> you want a grape on there? Ah! Oh. Yeah, that's the good stuff right there. Good morning, everybody. I'm so sunburned. My nose is sunburned. My lips are sunburned. My hands are sunburned. <laughs> But we had so much fun yesterday. Sebastian has already left for the airport. He left at like 3.50 or something absolutely crazy. So he's back in Salt Lake and now it's just me. I head out of here at like 1.20, I think. Uh, I should probably double check, but I didn't sleep well last night. I don't sleep well when Sebastian's not here and where we're located is like right next to a bar. So the cars were in insanely loud for us like insane so that was fun but i'm excited to get back home i hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog i when i go on trips i always have these big dreams and ideas of how the vlog is going to turn out and then i get frustrated along the way if it's not like that because it's like i don't watch back any of the clips and i never know what it looks like until i get back home so hopefully it's good i tried to enjoy myself we had such a fun trip and yeah, it was just, we always love San Francisco, so it was a lot of fun. And they also don't tell you that I literally have the worst, like, biker's butt, is what I'm calling it. <laughs> my butt and, like, my low, like, high thigh is wrecked. I'm in so much pain, so this will be interesting today. <laughs> We're gonna head out, or I guess I am gonna head out for breakfast, uh, just because I don't really want to be in the hotel alone anymore. And I don't know, maybe I'll call my mom. I just talked to Sebastian and he's home. So that's good. Um, oh, speak of the devil. ASOS Hall. Um, so <laughs> that's crazy. As far as that goes, I, I went a bit crazy, but you know what? Like, it's totally worth it because, you know, you need to spoil yourself from time to time. Um, <laughs> so to start off, one of my favorite shoes of all time. <laughs> okay, as I was saying, um, I'm going to go out and get breakfast before I have to head to the airport but if you saw my packing tips I just wanted to give a little outfit of the day so we have nice and cozy um, pants and then these are from the Goodwill I love them they're so freaking cute and then my little cropped sweater I think this is from forever 21 I can't remember and then my forever 21 trench coat so we are out and ready to get some breakfast. So let's go, let's say goodbye to this hotel and get out of here. Hi you guys, it is the next day, which is why I look like this. I'm very sorry about my appearance, but I'm just not gonna do anything. <laughs> um, I didn't vlog much of yesterday because holy moly. Well, first of all, look at how sunburned I am. Oh my gosh, this is a huge no-no for me. I do not get sunburned, so I'm really upset at myself. My hands are still pretty sunburned. Um, but we had a great time. I probably already said this, but I hope that you guys enjoyed. Um, but yeah, I didn't film anything yesterday because it was an insane day. As you guys saw, Sebastian left before me and I went to the airport. And I usually always get to the airport early just because I feel better that way. I'm a little anxious traveler, so it just makes me feel better when I know I can be there on time, get settled in, grab a snack, go to the bathroom, fill up my water bottle, that whole thing. So I knew I was going to get there early because I was by myself. Um, so I go to the, um, to the airport and I flew into SFO, the San Francisco airport. In my mind, it would make sense that I would fly out of there. <laughs> But I didn't check or anything. I just, you know, got an Uber to the airport, stood through security, went to go put my little boarding pass on the little security guy, and it went red, and he was like, oh, wrong one. And I was like, wrong one. But we did recently purchase um, tickets for another trip that we have coming up in a couple months. So I was like, oh, maybe I accidentally clicked that one. So then I click the one, you know, for yesterday and I, and it still beeps and it doesn't go through. And he's like, sweetie, you're at the wrong airport. And I was like, 
you have got to be kidding me and then I just like black out walk away and the only thing I did I started crying and I called Sebastian and I realized that my flight coming home was at San Jose which is so annoying and weird that it would do that I don't know why but that's what it was so I called Sebastian and I'm like oh my gosh what do I do like I have to go to San Jose and in my head like San Jose is like three hours away, right? Like, that's what I'm thinking. Um, thankfully, it was only 30 minutes away, so Sebastian was like, just call another Uber. Like, you'll have more than enough time. Um, so I call another Uber, and he takes me there, and he was super fast and speedy, which is what I asked for, so he was very kind to do that. <laughs> and I get to the airport with just enough time to check into my flight. There was no one in security, thankfully, and I got home safely. So it was... The, like, my worst fear is going to the wrong airport. Like, that just, I mean, in Utah, that doesn't really happen often. We only have our main one. But, like, other places, like, that's a, such a horrible fear to me. Or to, like, book a wrong ticket. I don't know, just have, like, something go wrong like that. And I just don't do well in stressful situations when I'm traveling. And especially by myself. Oh, my gosh. So I'm working on it. But... Yeah, it was insane. I'm so happy I made it home safely and everything worked out. It was great. I watched the movie, got comfy, everything was perfect. It was a great trip. It was super quick and just a nice weekend trip. We had a lot of fun. Hopefully the vlog turned out well and you guys enjoyed the footage. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. We are getting closer to 700. I'm so excited. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.